Alright guys, we're back again with Rashid playing The Last Guardian. So, yeah. what's happening here? Well, now it's the next day and as you can see the beast is awake and kind of looking healthy. No. But he wants to eat, so I keep feeding him these barrels. You've been feeding him these barrels, man, for a long time now. Oh, I knew he just ate that. What is in that barrel? Oil? Uh, you'll find out in the game. Okay. I don't want to ruin it. It's kind okay. of creepy. Creepy? <laughs> <laughs> Trust me, you're better off not knowing what's inside Baby that. tears? <laughs> <laughs> so, see, if you notice one thing, like, this is how, how the game works. So, it's, it's pretty much a puzzle platformer. So, that means you have to, you're going to encounter a lot of obstacles, uh, a lot of walls, basically, yeah. that you need to overcome and find a way around. Okay, okay. And sometimes you, you, you need to get that through uh, Trico, which is the name of the beast. Trico. Okay, or through the boy, who has no name. <laughs> Sounds like a corporation. Welcome yeah. to Trico. So like for... <laughs> okay, so basically, like for example, this is a really tight cave. Uh, okay. Trico can't come here, but I need to come in here to sort of like oh, go into these narrow places where he won't fit, obviously. Dude, look at that. Yeah, so they're, they put so much attention to oh like the... God. To like the setting you and the detail. You can just walk in the game and that's just like a tourist. Yeah, th that's actually one of the things... Uh, the director wants you is like to, is to just take in the scenery. That's basically. a tomb. Uh, no, I need to pick that up. This is one of the cool items you get in the game. So. Oh man. It's a mirror, that uh, that works with Trico. So here you're gonna see what it is in a bit. Uh, I need to go back. Uh, is that like water? Oh, yeah, it's it's God. basically oh. just I don't know. It's just like, yeah. Oh okay. Yes. Probably where they take baths or something. <laughs> <laughs> Out of baby tears. <laughs> Out of baby tears. So, uh, the game is because it's so puzzle focused. If you get stuck in a puzzle, uh, you get these pop ups to yeah. tell you, like, okay, no, this is what I did basically. And it kind of gives you a hint of okay. what you need to do next. Because okay. there are a lot of moments in this game I got stuck. <laughs> and, and they're like, oh, that's all I needed to do. You know, it made <laughs> me feel like an idiot. <laughs> so, uh, that's another thing. Also, one thing I want to point out about this game is it's one of the first games to uh, support PS4 Pro. <gasps> oh, yes. Yeah? Uh, we're actually playing this on a PS4 Pro, yeah, but we are. Uh, the footage we're recording right now is 1080. Yeah. But uh, the game can be played in like 4K. No way. So yeah. PS4 can actually produce 4K. Yeah, well, it's not like native 4K. It's more like uh, it's called checkerboard rendering. But okay. you won't like notice the difference. Like I personally don't really notice the difference. It's really good. Okay. Uh, especially for the value, you know, like. All right. Because a 4K machine would cost like a lot of money. Otherwise. I hear him, man. I hear him. So like, see, oh. you aim the mirror and he kind of does like this lightning thing out of his tail. <laughs> So you're gonna use that a lot for like enemies and stuff. Okay. So anyway, now I shooting need to lightning out of his tail. tail. <laughs> cool. If, if that wasn't enough, <laughs> you know, because he's already like I don't know, a freak of nature. <laughs> <laughs> no, but uh, yeah. So if you notice, like the so scale is. Dude, look at the feathers, man. It's just the details and every the reaction, the physics. It's amazing. Yeah. Seven years indeed. So you can even pet him. Oh, oh man. Because the thing is, when he gets into battles, he gets, like, after the battle is done, he gets angry. You know, it's interesting to see that, okay, you say this game, um, this game has been taken, like, seven years into production. So, you're telling me that seven years ago, these guys actually knew something powerful as the PS4 is going to be no, out? No, uh, well, the thing is, uh, th they were developing it originally for the PS3, obviously, at okay. the time. Uh, but something happened through during development, we don't really know what happened. Okay. Uh, it could be a number of reasons. And you usually I hear you. Think ha you know, because like game development, so it's really hard, you know? I hear you. So y sometimes you run into these sort of like troubles where okay. like whether it's budget or time or this guy left and suddenly you have to find a replacement, you know? It's a lot of things going behind uh, the scenes, It's a lot right? of things, yeah. So uh, it's it's not easy. Like as for the game engine, I think it's an in-house game yeah, engine? Yeah, it's in-house. Yeah, it's not like Unreal or anything. It's okay. Actually, it, it feels a lot like uh, Shadow of the Colossus. It has the same kind of feel. Okay. So if you played any of his games, they do have the similar kind of feeling. Actually, the, the, the locations mm. all kind of borrow the same kind of look and feel. Uh, again, big shout out to for me to Yoida for doing an amazing I job here. <gasps> Boom. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. So you're going to use that a lot for like puzzles. Uh, I, I want that pet. <laughs> Eventually, like it becomes like a laser beam, so it just shoots like. 
Like you level up or you just no, change? No, like it just changes. I don't know how it happens, but uh, it changes. So like whenever enemies show up, you just like... <laughs> <laughs> Tail up, shoot. Exactly. You have to call him. <laughs> oh wow. Oh wow. And you know, there are these moments where, like, you have to use, uh, uh, what's his name? Uh, Trico to, like, sort of uh, jump gaps. And it really feels awesome because, like, you feel like you're flying. Like, one, one area on Look at that. Yeah. So, 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 ha something happened there? No, no, you just blew up some pots. So. Dude, that's super awesome. Yeah, like so normally it does like a, it leaves a leftover because it's like fire, basically. Because you know? like, you know, in, in games, like, boom, you shoot, that's it, it's done. But yeah. it's like an after effect happening mm -hmm. there. Oh, this part's awesome. Oh, man, can you jump? Yeah, like yeah. a leap of faith? Okay. I just want to okay. show you guys this last part, at least, to kind of get a look and feel of the, the game's physics. Man. Come on, water's nice. <laughs> She's gonna show up, that is. Oh, there you go. Oh, there you go. Okay, <laughs> jump. <laughs> jump. Come on, do it. Jump. Jump. <laughs> jump. Come on, don't Please, be come on. Yeah, you can do this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come it's just on. water. It's just water. Baby tears, baby tears. See, he's just like my cat. He's like, I don't wanna do this. <laughs> <laughs> come on, man. Come on, you can do this. Leap of faith. Come, come on. on, come on. Jump, jump. Oh, oh he's oh. gonna do it. He's gonna do it. He's, he's gonna, gonna do it. it. Yeah. He's gonna yeah. do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yalla, 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 yalla. Come on. Okay. Taking like a few steps back first. Yeah, he's. You he can't tell with this guy. Okay, um, we need to ease him in. Like, like I don't. What should we say? Hey, free barrels. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna try to look for some. Look, barrels. butterflies. We want to see that jump, man. Okay, okay, he, he's he's close, right? Let's see. Okay, yalla, Come yalla. on. You can do this. You can do this, man. <laughs> <laughs> really? Hold on, I think there's. Okay, wait. Let me see if I can. Blow Illuminate. This oh. That's so handy. <laughs> that okay. The, uh, I'm guessing there's like a barrel here. So, for him to jump in, you need to give him a barrel. Yeah, basically to tempt him with food. <laughs> Just like your cat. Just like my cat. <laughs> he, he wouldn't do anything without food. <laughs> See? Sneaky slides. Okay. Oh wow, that's that's nice. Physics, I didn't even think he would do that. <laughs> I was just like, okay, fine. So I just push this down. Oh, there's a lot of barrels here. So I guess you know, you know, besides that's the fact you want to finish the story, you can just walk around, explore the environment, and just do stuff on the side, right? Just just. Well, no, what's the thing is about these games, they're kind of like really old school, and yeah. the fact that it's mostly like a very linear kind of experience. Okay, 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 okay. So he's gonna jump now. Yalla. Yalla, I'm bringing okay, okay. Oh wait, he's gonna do it. Okay, no? some motion here. No. Come on, look at the face. Okay, let me you get sure him. it's not the baby beast? The guy's like, he looks a bit cute. Let me get him the barrel. I think he just wants the barrel. Okay. It's like dealing with a real being here. Look what I got. Oh, look, his eyes are glowing. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, I want that. Food. Okay, go get it. Okay, Yalla. <laughs> Rush it. <laughs> Come well, on. Sorry. Hold on, let me, let me. Okay, now it should work. Kabudish. Come on, go get it. Now you have no excuse not to jump. Oh boy, here he goes. Okay, okay I'm waiting for this, man. <laughs> the moment of truth. <laughs> A leap of faith. Just jump. Oh, 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 oh my God. Look at the wave. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the wave. Oh, no. Oh, man. Oh. Uh, look, at, look at how the feathers get wet. See that? Dude, the mechanics, the physics is unbelievable. This game look at the reflection. It's beautiful. It's such a beautiful the, game. The, you know, it's lit underneath yeah. as well. And you know, the, you can play this game in HDR. So if your TV supports that, basically what it does is combines like the good blackness and yeah. a light or something. Okay. I, don't, I can't go into the details, but it basically gives you a more clearer picture. And it looks, oh, man. it basically makes the colors pop. Yeah, I, I don't think any TV can actually handle this kind of graphics now. I mean, if, especially if it's a pro. <laughs> Here's another one. So yeah, I mean, I guess Aren't that's too generous. Basically, it. Oh, speaking of which, my okay. cat's here. <laughs> <laughs> well, your cat can meet Trico. Yeah. So. Okay. Yeah. Well, pretty much it is this happening here, guys. Thank you so much for watching us here with the Last Guardian. And now we're gonna go back a little bit to the studio. But before that, we're gonna have some gameplay on the side for you guys to enjoy the Last Guardian. And of course, special thanks to PlayStation Middle East. Till next time with VG55. Bye, guys.